made it. Just got dropped off, and we got about a five mile hike up to our campsite. It's gonna be kind of like our first day of like really getting out and putting some time into the fishing and exploring. All right, well, we're out here, and uh, it started pouring on us. It's supposed to be really cold tonight, so we're just gonna hang out. We're trying to get all our clothes dry. That's why we got this fire going. We'll get some food, lay low, and then uh, hope for the best tomorrow. Wake up, snow on the ground, snow in my boots, snow everywhere. And Scotty's up early, trying to get the fire going. And uh, I whip around and there's a, uh, a wild boar hanging out near our campsite. Boar was right here, we are right there. I have this outside blue hammock and I was able to look up and see him. And I looked over here. And he was big boy. He was big, man. He was looking back at me, and I just said, told Scotty to get in his tent or in his hammock. And then he, he started yelling at him, and he just booked it. He took off, but a little scare for sure. And now we, we got a fire going, finally helping us a lot, and uh, trying to get some coffee going, some oatmeal, warm ourselves up. It's a cold morning. Cold morning for sure, but we're gonna try to push through, get some fishing done. Yeah. I'm so <laughs> not exactly like uh, biscuits and gravy at Bojangles, but you never had their biscuits and gravy. It's the only thing I do. Oh my god. Wouldn't want to eat anything else right now. This is frozen laces. <laughs> I have to leave them tight. Dude, I can't. This is going to be a loose boot. Illinois <laughs> now dances on the lake. Now you're talking about Bernie being upside down. Boys, but it's a pretty man. beautiful little rainbow. I love those blue spots, man. Purple, man. It just started snowing again, which, if you think about it, we're kind of caught between like yesterday was warmer and raining, but we'd rather it be colder and snowing because we're not getting wet. But either way, it sucks. But we're making the best of it. The only thing I can think of is when you're setting, you like to try and take it to the right. Try and just keep it high, okay? Take it up. Yeah, just take it up and keep it up. Yes, sir! 
Oh, did you lose it? Yeah. Cook's had a bad day. Cook's day. Um, he's missed quite a few fish. But on the plus side, you know, we're seeing some action. You know, could be worse. Yeah, he's a little heated right now. It's okay. He'll get over it once he catches one. He's just got to stick one. He just had a lot of bad luck. We all have days like that. Not me personally, because I'm pretty good. But. <laughs> So this is our setup basically. As you can see we have a bunch of tarps hung up. Uh, but the main the main system that we have going are these uh, jack straps here. And basically we have these smaller yellow ones around the tree with a big steel D-ring on here. And these black ones hooked across the next ones. And yeah, we have a lot of other stuff going on in here. But it's all working off of this main system that, that we have. And uh, no, these sticks aren't part of it, but we had some makeshift uh, rigging to do uh, due to a lot of different types of weather thrown at us over this trip. Um, but these have done great. Uh, these were given us to us, given to us by uh, my stepdad, Andrew Hager. He works for American Cable and Rigging out of Asheville, North Carolina. Um, they've done really well, really well. So I definitely suggest that. To, uh, future campers, hikers, so yeah, that's what we got going. It's day four, we're just packing up our things right now. We have to catch a shuttle back uh, at the lake. I was about four to five miles back that way. But yeah, all in all, we had a great time. You know, it's really nice to be out here. You know, the conditions we were in, the fishing wasn't too great, but we still had a great time um, being out here, just getting away for a little bit. I mean, this is our spring break. It was, this would go to the beach, and I'd much rather be out here, honestly. And we're about to pack up our things, stuff our packs, uh, throw them on our backs, and hit the trail and uh, catch our shuttle. You ready to do this? Yeah, there's Shane. And just as we're about to leave, the sun comes out. Isn't that how it always goes, right? How you feeling, Cook? Tired. Almost there, though. I'm not tired because I'm just <laughs> slammed a few cliff bars. And uh, I'm guessing we're about like 15 minutes away. 10-15 minutes away from, from the boat ramp and then we're gonna chill. And we made it boys. We here. We did it. Woo. How we doing? Good. Good. Oh I know, right? Right when we got out. Boys, we made it. How you feeling boys? There's no way that's good. How you feeling, Shane? Huh? How you feeling? Relieved. Bro. This is the happiest day of my life. <laughs> How are they? Cold and stale and old, dude, but it's a damn good donut.
Gotta quit videoing me, man. <laughs> <laughs>